Netgear supports all industry-recognized Wi-Fi analyzer tools. For this example, we will be using Ekahau AI Pro. Firstly, our system engineer will load a picture of the project. The customer has highlighted in yellow the outside area that should be covered with Wi-Fi, which is the outdoor garden of a cafeteria, allowing customers to enjoy their coffee outdoors in the sun. The first step is to use the scale tool to determine the distance in pixels of the actual measurement as informed by the customer. From the last wall to the border of the perimeter, we have 125 feet, which in this case represents around 420 pixels in our picture. We use the scale tool to assign a ratio between pixels and feet. Next, we will use the attenuation area tool to determine the signal attenuation when hitting the main building. For this example, we will use a generic warehouse rack preset offering 18 decibels of attenuation per meter and set the building height at around 28 feet as informed by the customer. Our system engineer will then draw the entire building area. This will serve as an attenuation area for the wireless signal to be offered outside. Now let's use the requirement area tool to determine the entire area that should be covered by the wireless access points. We always want to extend coverage a bit beyond the limits of the designated area to avoid underspecifying our wireless system. Ekahau has all the information provided by Netgear about our outdoor wireless access point. You can select it from the drop-down menu. In this case, we will choose the WAX610Y. Once this item is placed in the space, you can see the heat map of the wireless signal coverage. Our WAX610Y is stronger than the average outdoor access point, so our system engineer must tweak the parameters, adjusting the power of the antenna to 25 milliwatts and set the access point height to a standard 15 feet. The map now shows the wireless area covered by the outdoor wireless access point, which is directional. So you can aim it at a specific area you want to cover. In this case, our system engineer angles it almost at 45 degrees to cover the center part of the outdoor area. The green indicate very good signal strength, yellow areas indicate a good signal strength, and we should avoid the orange areas. Therefore, our expert has already planned for a second outdoor wireless access point to cover the other half of the area. Both access points will have the same antenna strength of 25 milliwatts, and as you can see, the whole outdoor area is now green and well served by our outdoor wireless access points. Now that you've learned more about our outdoor wireless access points, let Netgear help you, saving time and providing the expertise you need to excel in your IT business. To request a remote site survey, simply email prowifidesign at netgear.com and start your projects with Netgear right now.